for every mix engineer and producer, I think there does come a time in our career where we just want to start going out on a limb and trying out different techniques that you don't really see in this environment. So a couple years ago, I was just fleshing out a couple ideas with a client that I had at the time, and this particular project required for the vocals to be a little bit more aggressive and a little bit more in your face. So I thought a really cool way of being able to bring this across was instead of using the plugins that I had at my disposal, actually using guitar pedals in parallel with my main vocal tracks. Today I thought I would share this technique with you. So the only three things that you would need for this specific technique is an interface, a reamp box, and any guitar pedals of your choice. Which in my case was the Focusrite Claret 8 Pre-X for my interface, the Radial Studio Reamper for my reamp box, and for the sake of this example using two of my favorite guitar pedals, the Walrus Audio Voyager and the Bondi FX Sick As. And the reason I like these two pedals is because the Bondi FX is a little bit more of a transparent drive and the Voyager has a little bit more of a high gain that focuses primarily on the mid-range to my ear. So generally the way that I go about doing this is sending my audio out of one of the line outputs on my Claret 8 Pre-X into the balanced input of my reamp box and from my reamp box into my guitar pedals and from my guitar pedals back into input one of my interface. For most cases when I'm doing this technique I keep the level of my reamp box at about 12 o'clock. And for this example, the volume on my Voyager was at about 12 o'clock, the gain was at about 10 o'clock, and the tone was also at 12 o'clock. And with the sick as the level being at about 10 to 11 o'clock, the gain being at about 12 o'clock, the bass being maxed out, and the treble being in between 11 and 12 o'clock. And from here, we're going to jump into the session so I can show you how I use this technique. So before I show you the impact that these pedals can have within your vocal mix, it is important for me to note that I do print these pedal reamps down to a mono track. And then from there I use these in parallel with my main vocals. So this is what the sick ass sounds like straight out of the pedal. And this is what the Voyager sounds like straight out of the pedal. This is my friend Victor Borba who is performing these vocals and for this particular part of this song it was really important to ensure that the vocals were going to punch through the mix the right way because this part of the song is extremely dense. There's a lot of things going on along the lines of synths, pads, not to mention the drums, bass, guitars, and any other tracks that I incorporated with this part of the song. So it was really important for me to allow for the parallel pedal reamps to really carry this part of the song and it just did an incredible job at doing so. So this is what the vocals sounded like before the Parallel Voyager and Sick As. Masking the fear Hide away from the tension And this is what it sounds like with both pedals blended in with the main vocals. Masking the fear Hide away from the tension I think it's probably pretty evident to you that I do allow these parallel attributes to carry this part of the song. For me, to my ear, I really wanted to hear a little bit more of that distortion since this part of the song is so big. For you, when and if you want to try this specific technique, you may very well want the main vocal to carry whatever song you're working on. For example, if you're working on a pop song, you may very well want your main vocals to carry the song. But if you're looking for a really cool effect, you may also want the distortion part to carry a specific part of whatever song you're working on. It's not unheard of for me to play around with different delay and reverb pedals as well. So don't be afraid of playing around with any effects or pedals that you have at your disposal. Just experiment, have fun, and happy mixing. Action! 